List of Saint Seiya Antagonists Antagonists. The following list comprises the various antagonistic factions that appear in the manga Saint Seiya and the sequel Saint Seiya Next Dimension, written and illustrated by Masami Kuromata. The antagonistic characters appear as various deities from Greek mythology who rule over the realms that form Earth. In addition, several factions aren't presented as soldiers of these armies, but as organizations who pursue their own ends. Black Saints The Black Saints in Heisheng Dushi Buritsuku Sainto, Buraku Sainto, alternatively spelled as Ankaku Saint Ankaku Sainto, Ankaku Sainto in the anime, appear as servants of the Bronze Saint Phoenix Iki on his quest to kill all the Bronze Saints. The Black Saints are former saints who were stripped from their title and cloth for using their strength for personal gain, turning to a life of crime and violence. All of them trained in Death Queen Island along with several sons from Mitsumasa Kido, but most of them died. Although there is a Black Saint counterpart for each one of the 88 constellations, Kurumata featured prominently only four in his manga, the dark equivalents of the protagonists, Black Pegasus Buritsuku Pegasasu, Buraku Pegasasu voiced by Shaidru Nakahara, Black Andromeda Buritsuku Andoromda, Buraku Andoromda voiced by Kanito. They were regarded as the most powerful among the Black Saints and were collectively known as the Black Four in Heisei Tan Wang Buritsuku Huo, Buraku Fo. Their cloths and techniques are counterparts to the ones from Pegasus Seiya, Dragon Shuryu, Andromeda Shun, and Cygnus Hyoga. Although there is only one counterpart of each cloth, in the manga the Black Dragon Saint has a blind brother that helps him to fight. Additionally, there are also several Black Phoenix Saints who refer to themselves as Ikki's Shadows, although in the anime one of them appears as the strongest one. The four Black Saints are defeated by their equivalents and in the manga they are later killed by the Silver Saints, who were meant to kill the Bronze Saints, but mistook them due to an illusion created by Ares Mu. Additionally, the Black Four were featured in the anime-inspired printed side story Nebula Chain the Bond of Brothers, in which they were given names. Black Pegasus was known as Kenuma Kenuma, Kenuma, Black Swan was called Jidzido, Jido, Black Dragon was named Shinate Hero, Shinate Hero, Shinate Hero, and Black Phoenix was called Ritaho, 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 leaving Black Andromeda unnamed. Django Ziango, Django. Voiced by Banjo Jingo, 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 Banjo Jingo, Go Jingo, 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 who stole the phoenix cloth and kept it until it was retrieved by Hickey, who afterward killed him. Blue Warriors The Blue Warriors Vinjanshi Buri Warrior, Buru Warrior, Lit. Ice Warrior are an order of powerful warriors from the ice lands of Bluegrad known as Sinigrad in English publication, who also draw their strength from their cosmo. Their order was formed centuries ago by mighty warriors who, in the same way as Athena's saints, were capable of rending the skies with their fists and splitting the earth with their kicks. The Blue Warriors were led by Alexer Arakusa, Arakusa, Prince of Bluegrad, and protected their homeland against any menaces. They were presented by Kurumari in Vol. 13 of his manga, in the short story arc. He dedicated to Hyoga Kari no Kuni no Natisha in the chapter of Natisha, from the lands of ice. Their only known technique, his blue impulse. The marine realm, Mulan realm. In the same way, Athena has saints. Poseidon has an army that has assisted him since the age of myth. Sea fighter. With Poseidon's undersea temple serving as its base in the marine realm, Hijai, Kaikai, it is formed by hundreds of low ranking soldiers and commanded by seven powerful warriors known as generals, whose cosmo rivals that of a gold saint. These generals don armors called scales Lingyi Sukeru, Sukeru lit. Scale mantle, which are said to be as resilient as the gold cloths, 
and are modeled after marine creatures of legend. Their duty is to defend the mammoth pillars Ju Daju Manmasupira, Manmasupira of the Seven Oceans North and South Atlantic, North and South Pacific, Arctic, Antarctic, and Indian that safeguard the undersea temple. The strongest pillar, the main breadwinner Main Buriduina, Main Buridoina, is defended by Poseidon himself. Seeking Poseidon High, Huang Poseidon, Kaio Poseidon, 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 voiced by Asamu Saka, Keichi Nan, ba, 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 ba. As in Greek mythology, the Greek god Poseidon is the ruler of the seas, brother of Hades and Zeus. In Kurumada's story, he reincarnates on earth by taking the body of a chosen member of the Solo family as a vessel for his soul. This Greek family is one of the wealthiest in the world and enjoying Poseidon's blessing, has held hegemony over the seas for millennia. In the 20th century, the god takes the body of the family's young heir, a teenager named Julian Solo Zurian Soro, Jurian Soro, and strikes the earth with incessant rains to cleanse it of humans, whom he considers evil and unworthy of the blessings of the gods. He wishes to build a utopian society on top of the ruins once all humans are eradicated and to exact revenge on Athena for having sealed his soul after their last battle 2,000 years before. To this end, he holds Athena hostage in his undersea temple with the help of his army. He is ultimately sealed by Athena in her amphora, but later proves that he is not an evil deity as he awakens briefly to help the bronze saints fight Hypnos and Thanatos in the Hades Ark by sending them the gold cloths. Mermaid Thetis Ren Ujai Mamedo no Tesu, Mamedo no Tetesu, voiced by Hiromi Tsuru, a loyal servant of Poseidon bound to him by a debt of life. Thetis was saved by Julian Solo when he was a little boy. She was then a beautiful fish, stranded on a beach, and Julian tossed her back into the sea. During Poseidon's kidnapping of Athena, she served as a mediator between the factions of Poseidon and Athena. Thetis is not one of the mariner generals, but a middle-ranking soldier, as she is superior to the mariner rankless soldiers but subordinate to the mariner generals. She was unable to assist the mariner generals due to her defeat by Ophicius Shana. The saint spared her life and Thetis ended rescuing Julian Solo from the collapse of the underwater sanctuary after Athena removed Poseidon's soul from him. Thetis turned back into a fish as she died and Julian, upon finding it, led it back into the ocean, finally laying her to rest. Rankless mariners of being no high do she marina. So we are no marina. The vast majority of Poseidon's army, counted by the thousands, Unlike Athena's and Hades' rankless soldiers, the rankless mariners possess mastery over Cosmo to some degree, as they wield low-level superhuman strength and also wear weaker versions of the scale armors worn by their superiors, the mariner generals. Poseidon's mariners The seven most powerful warriors of Poseidon and Commander Generals Hai Jang Jun Zinararu, Generaru of his army, endowed with might that equals or surpasses that of a gold saint. The mariner generals wear the scale armors, said to be as resilient as the gold cloths. Seahorse Bayan Haima Shivasana Bayan Shivasu no Bayan, voiced by Shohayaman. Bayan was the protector of the North Pacific Ocean's mammoth pillar, one of the eight that kept the water above from drowning the underwater sanctuary. He had sworn to protect the pillar at all costs. Pegasus Seiya was the first to reach him and initially struggled with the mariner. Months before, Seiya had defeated the Silver Saint Lizard Misty, a man that, like Bayan, used air currents to render himself invulnerable. With the experience reaped from that battle and his reinforced cloth, the Saint soundly defeated Bayan. Sila Eo Sukurinoeo, Sukurinoeo, voiced by Say Futamata, 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 the devoted guardian of the South Pacific Ocean Pillar. Upon Andromeda Shun's arrival, Io tried to deceive the saint with an illusion of a maiden. 
This did not work in the end, and so they faced each other in battle. Yo used attacks that matched the six creatures that made up the Scylla beast from Greek myth, but, after withstanding Scylla's attacks, Shun was able to successfully counterattack each of them. Shun spared Io, but as he prepared to destroy the pillar with the weapons of the Libra cloth, Io, compelled by his adamant, devotion to Poseidon jumped in front of the attack to stop it. Io's attempt failed, and he was thus killed. Chrisayor Krishna Kuryuseyor Nakurishiyuna, Kuryuseyoru no Kurishanan, voiced by Masaharu Sato. Krishna was the guardian of the Indian Ocean Mammoth Pillar. He employed a golden lance and spiritual power derived from the Kundalini Transcendental Forces. Dragon Shuryu challenged the Chrisayor Mariner. The lance proved to be too much for the dragon saint until he remembered that the spirit of Excalibur laid in his right arm, handed down to him by Shura. Thus, he was able to break the lance in half. Krishna was not phased and meditated to flare his cosmo to the maximum, unleashing a final attack on Shuryu. The combat ended with Dragon Saint hitting Krishna's chakra points while losing his sight from Krishna's attack. Krishna was defeated, and Shuryu destroyed the pillar with the help of Kiki. Limnades Kakra Reumanate Sonakasa, Humanate Su no Kasas, voiced by Kitan Yamada. Known as the hunter of hearts and regarded as the most fearsome mariner, Kaka was responsible for the Antarctic Ocean Mammoth Pillar. He protected it by means of treachery and deception, as he was able to draw from a person's most cherished feelings and turn them against them by masquerading as someone they held dear. He took out Pegasus Seiya, Cygnus Hyoga, and Andromeda Shun with his illusions. However, when Phoenix Iki first arrived, Kaka was unable to sense any treasured feelings. He only found one enclosed deep in the saint's heart. This, however, angered the phoenix saint, leading to the limnade's mariner's death. Kraken Isaac Kurake no Izutsuku, Kurakin no Ezuku, 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 Ezuku. Voiced by Yusei Nakao. Isaac was once a righteous saint apprentice along with Cygnus Hyoga in Siberia, until suffering an accident while he saved Hyoga from drowning. Isaac lost one of his eyes and was falling to the bottom of the ocean unconscious when the Kraken rescued him and took him to Poseidon's underwater sanctuary in the Mediterranean. There he became a mariner and guardian of the mammoth pillar of the Arctic Ocean. Upon the saint's attack on the underwater sanctuary, he came face to face with Hyoga and blamed him for everything that had gone wrong years ago. Cygnus Hyoga eventually overpowered him after unsuccessfully trying to repent to his old friend. As he died in Hyoga's arms, Isaac congratulated his friend for becoming so powerful. Siren Sorrento Haimo New Serena Sorrento, Saren no Sorrento. Voiced by Yakushuye, the guardian of the South Atlantic Ocean Pillar and a virtuoso of battle music. During Poseidon's cleansing of the world, the Siren Mariner was ordered to kill the four bronze saints, Seiya, Hyoga, Shun, and Shuryu, who were comatose in a hospital. He met with Taurus Aldebaran's resistance, but Athena interrupted the battle, ordering Sorrento to take her to Poseidon. He obliged and returned to the underwater sanctuary. Later, when the saints invaded, he faced Andromeda Shun, who after a fierce fight managed to defeat Sorrento, and destroy his pillar. During the events, Sorrento became suspicious of the sea dragon mariner, concluding that Poseidon's resurrection and the ensuing war were the results of sea dragon's ambition, and not Poseidon's. These suspicions were confirmed during Phoenix Ikki's battle against sea dragon Canon. After Athena sealed Poseidon's soul and returned to the surface, Sorrento did the same and sought out Julian Solo, the former host of Poseidon's soul. Together they decided to travel the world and help the people that suffered in the catastrophe caused by Poseidon. Sorrento was still with Julian when Poseidon reawakened and sent help to the bronze saints in the battle in Elysium. Sea Dragon Canon High Long Shidoragana Canon, Shidoragon No Canon, Sea Gold Saint Gemini Canon. The Underworld Realm Hades, King of the Underworld Mingwang Heitsu, Meo Heitsu, Voice actor, Yuta Kasuya in Shun's body, 
Akio Atsuka in spirit form and in his true body, you body, you body. Amend in his true body, you body, you body, you body, you body. In his true body, in his true body, in his true body, in his true body, body, in his true body. The god who rules the underworld, Mingjai, Meikai, and Athena's true enemy. Aided by the fearsome Hypnos and Thanatos, his closest subordinates. Both Hades and Athena have engaged each other in a long-standing conflict for domination of Earth that spans across millennia, sparking bloody holy wars in the ages of myth, the 15th, 18th, and 20th centuries. Hades, whose beautiful body is the spawn of the union between Cronus and Re, was subjected to a traumatic experience in the ages of myth. Thus, Hades decided to put his true body to rest in the unreachable Elysian, until his dominion over earth is secured. To be able to incarnate, Hades then chose the body of the purest human in the era of his return, as a host for his divine soul, being alone his chosen vessel during his incarnation in 1747, and Andromeda Shun in 1990. The god of the underworld was defeated by Athena and her saints in each of his incarnations, at the high cost of the saints' lives and havoc over the land. Particularly bloody have been the encounters between the deities in the 18th and 20th century. During the latter, Hades retreats to shelter himself in the underworld, believing himself safe from Athena and her saints who devise a way to invade underworld. Determined to achieve domination of Earth whatever the cost, Hades unleashes the greatest eclipse phenomenon on Earth, which would conceal the sun, turning the planet in a gelid graveyard, and exterminating all life. Against all odds, Hades is later rejected by his chosen vessel Shun, and retreats to the Elysian and captures Athena, and places her in the lethal great amphora, assuming the saints would never be able to trespass the wailing wall in time to save their goddess life. He is proven wrong by the saint's tenacity, and the ruler of the underworld is forced to revive his true body, dormant for millennia since the ages of myth. Athena, freed from the amphora, joins her saints in the battle, and after a brief but costly battle, against all odds, Hades is finally defeated. The mortal world is saved from the greatest eclipse and the Elysium collapses, but Seiya was also defeated in the battle, being pierced in the heart by Hades' sword, and put into a curse which kept him in a catatonic state. In the manga sequel Next Dimension, Hades is incarnated in a lone's body, a boy that as Shun has the purest body of the earth. Pandora Pandora Voice actor Maya Sakamoto The woman forever destined to unleash evil on earth. Pandora is the guardian of Hades' soul and his flesh sister in the 20th century. At a young age, she opened the forbidden box that was sealed by Athena and released Hypnos and Thanatos. She was told that Hades would become her brother, and she must protect him until the advent of the final battle. In exchange, they would grant her eternal life. She commands the first wave of specters to attack the sanctuary in the name of Hades in the final arc of the manga. She was given a necklace that allows her to travel through different realms, and she has a complex relationship with Aki due to their past regarding Shun. As Hades's sister, she was his slave and was unable to see fully in color, but, after seeing Iki's iron will, she regained her sense of color and her lost memories. Because she gave Iki the necklace, she was deemed a traitor and killed by Thanatos. Pandor also appears during her 18th century incarnation, fulfilling the role given to her as destiny. Ability, teleportation, telepathy spear, ability to summon lightning. Thanatos, the god who rules death, siwo siru shen tanatasu, shi otsuka sedoru kami tanatasu. Voice actor, Toshio Furukawa, Rokawa, Rokawa. The god of death and a close servant of Hades, who has fought against Athena's saints since the ages of myth. He, along with his twin brother Hypnos, reside in Elysian and see to their gods' ambitions. Thanatos is the more impulsive of the brothers, was quick to attack Athena's bronze saints when they arrived in Elysian, deeming their trespass blasphemy. When Thanatos was bruised by Pegasus Seiya, he was personally offended 
and even went to the lengths of trying to kill the saint's sister. This did, however, backfire as Sayer rose to a new level of power, resurrecting his god cloth, and soon defeated the god. Hypnos, the god who rules, sleep my and re wo si ru shin hu punasu, nimiri o tsuka sed uru kami hu banasu. Voice actor, isay futamata, 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 futamata. The god of sleep, also a close servant of Hades, and the twin brother of Thanatos who has fought against Athena's saints since the ages of myth. Hypnos was more cautious than his brother and stayed out of the way from Athena's bronze saints. He did, however, act when the saints gained a higher form of power as he thought them to be dangerous to the gods themselves, as he was a witness of the power of the god cloths in the ages of myth. In his effort to stop Pegasus Seiya, he was, however, halted by the other bronze saints as they each successfully resurrected their god cloths and severely wounded the god. Hypnos lived long enough to sense the moment when Hades' true body was awakened, but succumbed to his injuries soon after. Kur, the goddess who rules destiny, Yun Ming Wo Si Ru Shen Kuru, on Meo Tsukasetaru Kami Kuru. Recently introduced by author Kurumada in the complimentary story Saint Seiya, Origin, and also referred to as Wicked Goddess Kurzai Shen Karu, Jashin Karu, the goddess of violent death, younger sister to Hypnos and Thanatos and subject to servitude to them. She is directly responsible for Gemini Saga's perversion, as she used her feared bed omen star on him, causing him to be possessed by an evil spirit, the origin of his rebellion against Athena. The Spectres, the Spectres, Spectres, the Spectres, the Spectres Mingdu Shi Supercuta Supercuta, lit. Dark fighters are the equivalents of Athena's saints in Hades' army. The 108 Spectres, 36 ranked as heavenly stars, with the remaining 72 being earthly stars as well as their respective epithets are based on the 108 stars of destiny from the classic Chinese novel Water Margin. The proof of their status is found in the armors they wear, cold surplices, mingi sapurisu, sapurisu, lit, dark mantle, said to shine as a dark diamond. The leadership of Hades' army is formed by the collective known as the three magnates of underworld whose might surpasses those of the gold saints. Heavenly Fierce Star, Wyvern Radamanthes Tian Mingzing Weben or Damantesu, Tenmosai Weben no Radamantesu, Voice Actor, Teikito Koyasu, the first of the three Spectre Magnates to be introduced by Kurumada. Against Pandora's orders, he sends a task force of Spectres to Athena's sanctuary to keep tabs on the revived Gold Saint's mission. When the task force fails, he is punished by Pandora but remains on Earth in Hades' castle. When the Bronze Saints arrive, his subordinates take care of them, leaving Radamanthes free to descend to the underworld, where he eventually faces off against Gemini Canon, but their fight is interrupted. He later kills Lyre Orphe when the latter tries to assassinate Hades. He later meets Canon again, and after a long battle, the Saint relinquishes his cloth and performs a suicide attack on Radamanthes, ending their lives. Heavenly Noble Star, Griffin Minos Tin Gui Zing Giri Huanamanasu, Tenkai Sai Girifin no Minasu. Voice Actor, Kuichi Tu Chikuk. Minos is officially the judge of the souls of the dead that come to the underworld. He appeared during Orphe's assassination attempt on Hades, which he slept through by the saint's power. He later came to face against Gemini Canon, but was told to leave by Wyvern Radamanthes. He was injured when he stumbled upon the wailing wool just as the gold saints pierced it with a burst of sunlight. He then chased the remaining bronze saints to the other dimension lying past the wall, where he was ultimately pulverized by the pressure of that dimension, that only divine blood could repel. Heavenly Noble Star, Griffin Vermeer Tan Gui Zing Giri Hui no Hurumaru, Tenkai Sai Girifin no Furumaru. Vermeer, the Heavenly Noble Star, is the griffin spectre of the Holy War of the 18th century. After Pandora and Hades have made their way to the castle, he sets out to finish Ares Shin, Librodoko, and Pegasus Tenma. With little effort, he overpowers Tenma and thus starts fighting the two gold saints. 
His first move is throwing them high up in the air to demonstrate his power, seeing as they are inside Hades' barrier which weakens the saint's power tenfold. He then proceeds by using his cosmic Marionchin technique and traps the saints, whom he tortures by breaking Doko's hand. But as he is about to break Shin's neck, Goyuda Suakayo appears. He tells him that Pandora is looking for him and that he doesn't need to exterminate the saints. Heavenly Valiance star Garuda Ayakos Tianxing in Garudano Ikasu. Tenusei Garuda no Ayakasu. Voice actor, Shinakairo Miki. Shinakairo Miki. One of the three specter magnates, being fierce and proud. He also attends Orphe's performance, which he sleeps through due to the saint's power. He later faces up against Phoenix Aki, whom he gravely underestimates, eventually leading to his demise. Heavenly Expansion Star, Akron Charon Tan Giant Zing Akron Akron, Tenkensei Akron No Karen, Voice Actor, Chiro Sato. Just as in the myths, Charon was responsible for ferrying the dead over the river Akron in hell. He had a knack for singing during the trip, which he charged a silver coin for. One day the warriors of Athena arrived, the saints Pegasus Seiya and Andromeda Shun. The specter bickered and fought with the saints, but would ferry them across if they could pay him. Shun offered his pendant, but the specter gave it back when he thought the Andromeda saint actually had a chance to enter Elysium. With Pegasus Seiya, he was however not pleased with, and after reaching the other shore, they made a standoff where Seiya was the victor. Heavenly Expansion Star, Akron Nyan Tian Gui Zing Akron Nian, Tenkensei Akron No Nyan, a young female specter. Akron Nyan is the incarnation of the Akron specter in the 18th century. As a ferrywoman, Nyan guards the shores of the Akron River in the underworld, taking the dead to the other side upon receiving her payment. She meets Taurus Ox and is shocked to realize he is seemingly alive until Ophiuchus Odysseus suddenly arrives. Nyan is the first female specter created by Kurumada and presented in his work. Heavenly Heroic Star, Balron Rene Tianying Zing Baron Run, Tenaize Baron No Run, Voice Actor, Suzumu Chibaba. When Griffin Minos was unavailable to perform his duty as the judge of departed souls, his subordinate Balron Rene stepped in to wield his whip. At one of these moments, Rene encountered the saints of Athena, who were invading the underworld. It was first the Pegasus and Andromeda saints who he performed a judgment on, but he had already been put under an illusion by Gemini Canon. As such, nothing he did took place, even cutting Shun, the soon to be Hades' body, to pieces. Terrified for his blasphemy, he ran outside to search for the body which had mysteriously disappeared. Along the way, he encountered Wyvern R.H. Demanthes, who exposed the Gemini saint's bluff. Rene caught Canon with his whip, but the saint sent a cosmo spark through the whip which destroyed him. Heavenly Beast Star, Sphinx Pharaoh Tans, Luzing Suhuin Kusano Huero, Tenjusei Sufin Kusuno Pharaoh. Voice Actor, Janachi Suwebe. Pharaoh was once one of Hades' most favored specters due to his musical talents on his demon harp and the guardian of the second prison in hell. However, when one of Athena's warriors, the saint called Lyra Orphe arrived in hell to free his love. Pharaoh was ordered by Pandora. This led much to Pharaoh's chagrin when Orphe became the new favorite musician of Hades. The stink specter came to resent the saint since then, and would do anything to reclaim his favored position. When the bronze saints of Pegasus and Andromeda arrived at his prison, he sent his beloved pet Cerberus on them, but with little effect. The liar saint suddenly interfered and made the bronze saints unconscious while saying to the specter that he was going to dispose of them. Pharaoh didn't believe him completely and followed him, and just as he expected the saint had tricked him and let the saints live. In his joy to finally be able to dispose of the liar saint, Pharaoh revealed that he was the one that had tricked Orphe. This did, however, backfire as it made Orphe very angry and in a fierce battle of lethal music, Sphinx Pharaoh met his end. Heavenly Diabolical Star, Alron Queen Tian Mozing Aron Inocuin, 
Ten may say Aaron no quin, 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 no quin. Voice actor. You say oh do do say oh 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 do you say oh do 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 say you say oh do say oh do say oh do say you say oh do say oh do Queen was more cheerful than his two companions Gordon and Silphid who all served under Wyvern Radamanthes. Queen first appeared in Hades' castle on earth where he pummeled the bronze saints a little. He then retreated to the underworld where he wouldn't appear until Athena's saints had broken through the wailing wall to Elysium. Dragon Shuryu valiantly stood to protect his fellow saints and in the ensuing battle Queen underestimated him and was soon killed. Heavenly imprisoning star Minotauros Gordon Tan Lousing Minotaurus on a garden, Tenrosa Minotaurusu no Badon, Gadan, voice actor, Hiro, Wo, Hiro. Gordon was the more aggressive than his two companions, Queen and Silphid, who all part of Wyvern Radamanthes' troops of the 108 Spectres. Gordon first appeared in Hades' castle on Earth, where he pummeled the four bronze saints. He then retreated to the underworld, where he wouldn't appear until Athena's saints had broken through the Wailing Wall to Elysium. Dragon Shuryu valiantly stood to protect his fellow saints, and in the ensuing battle Gordon underestimated him, and was soon killed by an outburst of the saints' cosmo. Heavenly victorious star, Basilisk Silphitine Jising Bezerasukona Shuruhuido, Kenshosai Bajarasuku no Shurufido, voice actor, Tetsu Inaded. The Basilisk Spectre acted like the leader of his two companions, Gordon, and queen who served under Radamanthes. They all appeared in Hades' castle, on earth where they pummeled the bronze saints a little. They then retreated to the underworld where the three specters wouldn't appear until Athena's saints had broken through the wailing wall to Elysium. Dragon Shuryu valiantly stood to protect his fellow saints and in the ensuing battle, despite warnings, he followed them through the wailing wall, and without divine blood, surplus armor couldn't withstand the pressure and was vaporized along with him heavenly wailing star harpy valentine tan kuzing happen aberentane tenkaku say happy no barentane voice actor ig take loto valentine is one of wyvern radamanthe's loyal followers and protects him from something he regards as insignificant like a bronze saint of athena he first appeared in Hades' castle on earth where he fought with Pegasus Saya but said he would fight him again eventually. When the bronze saints had reached Hades' palace in the underworld called Judeca, Valentine was ordered to dispose of the phoenix and Pegasus saints' bodies in the icy plains of Cossiutus. Though when Pegasus awoke the saint said he had Athena's cloth with him, and as such Valentine took him out of the ice. The saint persisted to hold on to the cloth and eventually retaliated against the harpy spectre, who was defeated in an instant by hundreds of kicks. Heavenly crime star, like Aeon Fledges Tan Zui Zing Ryukeano Hiregiasu, Tenzeze Yukeon no Firigiasu. Voice actor, Kiyuki Yanada. Fledges served as the warden of the dark lake of the fourth prison in hell. When the saints of Athena had infiltrated the underworld, the specters were on high alert. Cygnus Hyoga, Dragon Shuryu, and Gemini Canon reached the Dark Lake together, but the only way to get across was by Phlegia's raft. He immediately attacked them, knocking the bronze saints unconscious with ease. Both landed on the raft, which Canon pushed out into the lake and stood ready to fight the specter. But the Gemini Gold Saint was far more powerful. Phlegias was killed by a single attack from Canon, leaving him free to jump on the raft. Heavenly Horned Star, Golem Rock Tan Jayo Zing Gormanoritsuku, Tenkakuse Gormu no Raku. Voice Actor, Yasuhiko Kawazu. The Guardian Spectre of the Third Prison of Hell, Golem Rock, tried to kill Gemini Canon, Dragon Shuryu, and Cygnus Hyoga with a mudslide. Failing in the attempt, 
an enraged rock tried again to kill the saints with his signature technique only to be killed by the overwhelming strength of shuryu heavenly vanquished star troll ivan tan by zing toru noiwin tenpeze toru voice actor keiji harai the second guardian specter of the third prison of hell troll ivan is easily killed by cygnus hyoga while trying to introduce himself to the trespassing saints heavenly hideous star Deadly beetle stand tin chu zing dit sudo robotor na sutando, ten chu se dead ori by toru no sutando. Enormous in size, the bulkiest specter in Hades army, he appears briefly, collapsing after being killed by Gemini Canon. Earthly violence star, Cyclops gigant di bowsing sekurapu son a giganto, chubosai sekurapu su no giganto. Voice actor, hisao agawawawa. Agawawawa, Agawawawa. Cyclops Gigant was the leader of the Spectre Force sent by Wyvern Radamanthes to invade Athena's sanctuary. He was sent to keep tabs on the revived Gold Saints, who were supposed to kill Athena, whom they had served before. The Gold Saints did, however, disappear, so the Spectres saw no way but to continue the mission on their own. Gigant and his companions managed to get as far as to the Virgo Temple. During their encounter, it was revealed that the gold saints had killed and disguised themselves as some of the specters. The gold saints was however allowed to pass through the temple, and so the specter thought they were also allowed. But Shaka immediately attacked and killed all six remaining specters. Kigint squirmed with his last breath that those who served Hades would be rewarded with eternal life. Shaka replied that he, who had conversed with gods in the past, had never been told a human had been given eternal life. Kigant gasped in horror as he realized that Hades had tricked them before he died. Earthly secret star, Dalahan Cube Dayin Zing Deurahan Akubu, Chiensei Deurahan no Kubu. Voice actor, Ryotaro Okie, sent among the seventeen specters infiltrating Athena's sanctuary to keep tabs on the revived gold saints. During the invasion, the revived gold saints feigned their defeat in an attack from Virgo Shaka. In the confusion, Saga killed Cube and took his surplus as a disguise. The Dullahan surplus covered most of the body, so it was a very suitable disguise. Earthly lowly star elf mills dilizing Iruhanamaruzu, Kairitsuse Irufu no Maruzu. Voice actor, Nabutoshi Kanan. Sent among the seventeen specters infiltrating Athena's sanctuary to keep tabs on the revived gold saints. During the invasion, the revived gold saints feigned their defeat in an attack from Virgo Shaka. In the confusion, Aquarius Camus killed Mills and took his surplus as a disguise. The elf surplus covered most of the body, so it was a very suitable disguise. Earthly running star Gorgonox dies using Gaganakusu. Chisosai Gaga no Akusu. Voice actor, Teichi Kusao, sent among the seventeen specters infiltrating Athena's sanctuary to keep tabs on the revived gold saints. During the invasion, the revived gold saints feigned their defeat in an attack from Virgo Shaka. In the confusion, Capricorn Shura killed Ox and took his surplus as a disguise. The Gorgon surplus covered most of the body, so it was a very suitable disguise. Earthly magic star Papalin Mu Dai Yaozing Papiana Mu Chiosai Papian no Mayo. Voice actor Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. 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 Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Atsushi Kaseichishi. Kaseichishi. The Papal Inspector is one of the few that were physically completely changed when he awakened as a specter. He reverted to a living form of a gel-like substance. During the invasion of Athena's sanctuary, the specters apprehended Ares Mu to interrogate him about the whereabouts of their guides, the revived gold saints. Mu interfered and told them to back off because he wanted to fight against the strongest psychic in the sanctuary, which he was also claimed to be in Hades' army. During the fight, he went through two stages of evolution, from the gel substance to a monstrous caterpillar, 
to a chrysalis in which he underwent his final transformation into an entomomorphic human their fight was a display of psychic strength which in the end was won by Ares Mu. Mew had the ability to spawn small butterflies called hell butterflies which he used to track his opponent with one of these survived and came to survey the rest of the invasion and they also appears in the eighteenth century holy war in next dimension finally the papal inspector appears during its reincarnation in the eighteenth century earthly magic star papal in julieta di yauzing papiana ziuriat suto chiosai papian no juriet appears in next dimension as one of pandora's assassins sent to murder sasha athena earthly darkness star deep neob di and zing de pononiob chayan se de pu no neob voice actor shingo horia Neo was the first specter to announce himself during the invasion of Athena's sanctuary. As the specters reached the Taurus temple, he stepped forward and defeated Taurus Aldebaran with a deadly pheromone. He chooses to stay behind momentarily as his comrades continued ahead. When Ares Mu arrived at the temple, he revealed himself by splitting the remaining figure of Aldebaran. The gold saint had, however, left a hint about Neob's deadly pheromone in his cosmo to Mu. Trying to engage Mu in combat, he was ignored by the latter, who considered Neob already dead. Neob was then completely torn apart by the delayed effect of Aldebaran's great horn. Earthly hiding star, warm Raimi diffusing women or Raimi, Chifuku say Wamu no Raimi, Wamu no Raimi, 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 Wamu no Raimi, no Raimi. Voice actor, Kazuya Nakai. Raimi was one of the seventeen specters, sent in secret by Wyvern Radamanthes to attack Athena's stronghold, Sanctuary. When the group reached the temple of Leo, five of them were immediately killed by its guardian, Leo Aeolia. As the other specters continued their attack, Raimi saw this as an opening and entangled the gold saint, claiming him to be his victim. However, the specter underestimated Aeolia, and after sending the other specters to the next temple, Raimi was soon killed by the Leo Gold Saint. The worm specter in the 18th century also appears briefly in Next Dimension, battling against Leo Kaiser, whom he is unable to defeat, and the specter is ultimately defeated by Cancer Death Toll with a humiliating attack. The name of the worm specter in that era was not revealed by Kurumada, although he wears the same surplus and his appearance is identical to Raimi's. Earthly strange star, Frog Zelos Daikaising Hiragunos Rasu, Chikaisai Furigu no Zirasu. Voice actor, Bin Shimada, 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 Shimada. Zelos was the one who sent the seventeen specters to Athena's sanctuary by the order of Wyvern Radamanthes. He acted as the messenger of the events in the sanctuary to Radamanthes even though he questioned Wyvern's decision due to Pandora's wrath. As the revived gold saints came to Hades' castle with Athena's body, Zelos was there to greet them. The gold saints disregarded him, and Aquarius Camus pushed him aside with his cold winds. Thus, when the revived saints lay dying on the floor due to their time limit, the specter took out his frustration on Camus. This would prove not in his favor as Cygnus Hyoga, and the other bronze saints burst through the ceiling. With his own cold blast, the Cygnus saint hastily killed the frog specter. Earthly strange star, frog mihin die kaising hirigunamian, chikaisai furigu no mihin, the frog specter in the 18th century. Gargoyle specter gagwaru no ming dushi, gagwaru no supercuter, cuter, supercuter, supercuter an unidentified character who briefly appears before Crateris Suakayo, conveying Hades' offer to become one of the three magnates of the underworld and save his younger brother Sui Sho's life in exchange of loyalty to him. Kurumada has yet to reveal his name and star, as the only confirmed fact is the mythical being represented by his surplus. Unnamed Spectres Kurumada also presented some spectres, that were killed promptly and thus were not identified except for their destiny stars appearing during the specter's assault in sanctuary earthly cheerful star dai la zing kairakusei 
Earthly wide star die kuo zing chikitsusei. Earthly swift star dai su zing chisikusei. Earthly punishing star dai zing zing chikasai. Earthly hidden star dai zang zing chizosai chizosai. Earthly insane star dai quang zing chikayosei. Earthy enslaving star dai nu zing chidosai at the Black Valley who tried to kill Gemini Canon. Earthly menacing star dai wei zing chiesai. Earthly fierce star dai ming zing chimosai. Earthly spirit star dai ling zing kairese guarding the cossetus prison in hell, voiced by dai masaru suzuki. Earthly shiny star dai ming zing chimaisai. Earthly advancing star dai jin zing kishinsei. Earthly retreating star dai tui zing chitaze. Earthly chasing star Dai Zhu Zing, Kyu Sai, and the final specters killed by Phoenix Iki at the Wailing Wall. Earthly evil star Dai Yi Zing, Chai Kyu Sei, Kai Kyu Sei. Earthly strong star Dai Shu Zing, Chisu Sei. Earthly simple star Dai Ping Zing, Chihai Zei, Chihai Zei, Chihai Zei. Earthly air star Dai Kong Zing, Chikyu Sei. Earthly reason star Dai Lai Zing. Kairai's 23 new specters were added to the Saint Seiya universe by Kurumata in Next Dimension, although they were not named and their destiny stars remained to be revealed. Nine of them were part of Gauyuda Suikayo's Kotter invading sanctuary, and other seven appear freeing cancer death toll in the hill to the land of spirits. One new specter appears among the Kotter killed by Phoenix Iki and death toll, the rest are specters from Kurumada's original manga appearing in their 18th century incarnation, and a few skeleton soldiers. Six new specters appear in Griffin Vermeer's Cotter Invading Sanctuary. Hades Skeletons Ming Wang Heitsu Jun Nozo Bing Sukaruten Meo Heitsu Gun Nozo Yo Sukaruten The rankless soldiers from Hades' army, wearing weaker versions of the specter surpluses, and armed often with sickles as they have no mastery over Cosmo. One of them, the rankless soldier skeleton Marchino Zobing Sukaruta no Marukino. Zoyo Sukaruta no Marukino is briefly featured prominently and as a comic relief. His voice was provided by Naoki Tatsuta. The Heavenly Realm Angels The Angels Tan Du Shi Enziru Enziru Lit Heavenly fighters or powerful warriors from the heavenly realm Tanjai, Tenkai, servants of the Olympic gods, and wearers of the glory Tanyi Gyurori, Gyurori, lit. Heavenly mantle armors. To date, Kurumada has shown them as loyal to the moon goddess Artemis. Angel Toma Tan Du Shi Enziru Du Ma. Enziru Toma. Voice actor Hikaru Midora Kawa Lo. Eagle Marin's long lost brother. Mentioned by Ophichis Shainit in the final volume of Masami Kurumada's manga. His background was further revealed in the Tenkai Hen Joso Tilde Overture Tilde Theatrical Feature and its introductory short comic book, offered by Kurumada in both of which he appears as an angel. His movie incarnation now remains out of the Saint Seiya canon, as he is now being featured in the latest installments of Saint Seiya, Next Dimension in which he also appears as an angel, chained in the prison of the moon and is released by Callisto, with the mission to assassinate Pegasus Seiya, his reward being his freedom if he fulfills it. His glory is specifically named Sleep Angel Version Glory Surapu and Zirubashi and Tanyi, Surapu and Zirubash and Gyori. His mission comes to a halt due to the intervention of Cygnus Hyoga and Eagle Marin, whom he finds familiar. Although Kurumada has retained many of his original traits, whether he will remain the same character portrayed in the film, the lunar realm, or realm, or realm, the lunar realm, you know, Shijai, Tsuki no Sekai is ruled by the beautiful goddess Artemis, older sister to Athena and younger sister of Apollo. Although Artemis initially shows hostility to Athena, she later offers her assistance. Despite this, Artemis' servants plot secretly to kill Athena and her saint. Additionally, the angels, the warriors of the heavenly realm, seem to have pledged allegiance to Artemis. 
Moon goddess Artemis, you know Nushin Aritemisu. Suki no Megami Aritemisu, the beautiful goddess of the moon and elder sister to Athena. The goddess is initially hostile to her sister due to her battles with Hades and Poseidon, though she reveals to Athena that the only way to remove Hades' curse from Seiya's body is to travel back in time with the help of Kronos. Her base of operations is the Temple of the Moon situated on the slopes of Mount Olympus. This temple is protected by numerous soldiers called satellites. Handmade Callisto she knew Karasuto, Jijo Karasuto, servant of Artemis and high-ranking officer among the satellites, the personal guard of Artemis. She is very caring of her goddess and will resort to anything for her safety. Callisto initially warns the goddess Athena not to visit Artemis because she is angered by the goddess of war's past conflicts. Athena refuses, so Callisto allows her to pass. She still deems her very risky to Artemis, so she later sends Laskamon, captain of the satellites, to kill Athena. After her failure, she resorts to sending the much more powerful warrior, Toma the Angel, to kill Athena's saints, releasing him from the lunar prison. In Chapter 30 of Saint Seiya Next Dimension, during Toma's reintroduction to the canon, Callisto replaces the shady, unidentified character that freed the angel in Kuromata's short introductory comic book for the now apocryphal Tilda Overture Tilda film. Moon which Hecate, you know mo new Hecate, Suki no Majo Hecate, the elderly witch of the moon. Kuromata based her on the mythological persona Hecate. She tricks Athena into cutting off her hair by means of an illusion of multiple pathways to the temple of the moon. She makes a brew with Athena's hair which restores her youth, becoming a young girl again. She then guides Athena to Kronos who in turn punishes her, turning her body into dust. Later, she resurfaces unharmed, as she was able to survive Kronos' assault. The young Hecate displays a childish and whimsical behavior, and has exhibited the ability to transform into a crow. Sometime after Athena's departure, she assists the saints in reaching Athena's garland, which leads them to the era of the past holy war. Hecate is a thousand years old, and it is the keeper of the road leading to the temple of Artemis, situated on the slopes of Olympus, which begins with a very large stone column, surmounted by a crescent moon. Satellites, s -s -s satellites. The satellites, Ueshi Saturato, Saturato, lit. Moon guardians are guardians of the moon and women slash soldiers of Artemis. The satellites are all excellent archer. Their armor recall the legend Japanese of the moon rabbits. Forces commander Laska Maun Yujai Dewey Chang, Rasukumun, Yujikitai Cho Rasukumun, captain of the satellites. Known to never let her target escape, Laska Maun is ordered by Callisto to kill Athena to spare grief to their goddess Artemis. Her subordinates are defeated in an instant by Andromeda Shun, but Laska Mound takes him down with her Crimson Viper attack, only to be interrupted by the arrival of the Phoenix Saint Icky. She is then seriously wounded by the Saint after a brief encounter with her own arrow. Her armor is black as it represents a viper. Anime only antagonists. Some antagonistic factions do not exist in Masami Kurumada's Saint Seiya manga, appearing only in the TV anime adaptation. These include the Ghost Saints, the Henchmen of Pope Ares, some Silver Saints, and Odin's Ascardians. 